Hey guys, and welcome back to Audit Watch, the best place to find your favorite police interactions on the internet. Don't forget to like the video if you enjoy, and subscribe if you're new around here. But anyways, let's get straight into today's episode. Private property, yeah. Or so let's see. We, we actually, if we if we had that up there and the signs were on there, we could actually pull them out of the car and lock them up. Turn them across that. Yeah, they but can't do, do that. This video is brought to us by LAC Audit. Be sure to subscribe to their channel and show them support by checking out their videos. As always, the link to the channel will be down in the description. The video begins with a man legally parked on a street. He has the cops called on him by a house owner nearby. The cop tries to get the man's ID, and let's just say isn't very successful in doing that. And then the cops say that the street is private. It's weird because there are no signs that state that. I'm doing good, how are you? I'm with the Millsburg Police Department. The reason why we're making contact, uh -huh. some lady came out to report that you've been sitting out here for over four hours. Okay. And we're just trying to find out what the deal is, what's going on. I'm sitting here minding my business, not doing anything. You got any credentials? I'm not going to provide that, just because of a call. Burn v. Texas. You, you told her that you're a correct? Yeah, that's what I told her. Okay. Do you yeah. have any credentials? Yeah, but I don't want to provide it right now. Why not? Huh? Why not? Because it's optional, and I just don't want to provide it right now. What's that? Because it's optional. If you're a you have to provide credentials to what you're going on, and you have to report it to the dispatcher that you're out here. No, but I didn't tell you that I was told her I was private. I'm not telling you that I am one. Well, this is private property, you know? This, what, what is private property? Private, what is private property? This roadway here? This road is private property. How is this road private property? Because it is. It's a development. It's oh. run by the HOA. Oh, where's, the, where's the sign that says private private property? There's no sign that says trespassing there. There's a public street. And there's no sign that says private parking there. Or private property. There's absolutely no signs. Well, no one's asked you for your information. Yeah, he did. Okay. That officer did. Well, you you don't have to give it to him. You're I right. know, but you heard, you heard what he said just now. What? I have your tags. I'm going to run the information. I'm going to run everything. Be, just because they invoke my rights. You think that's fair? I'm you're, not doing I anything mean, wrong. on a public street. Yeah. A lot of people park in a public street. That car is parked in a public street. So, you're, you're right. It, it's a, it's a, a public roadway. Mm -hmm. Um. So... You can park here. Um, we just, we're more concerned about what's going on. Yeah, but I dispelled your fears. Yeah, I yes, said, you're, you're right. Okay. I, what I'm doing, you guys have the tax, so no, you know, right? I'm not a single person reported a crime. They're just a suspicious car. Suspicion is not a felony or a misdemeanor. Yeah, I know. Right? That's why we made contact with you. Exactly. I'm, okay. I'm talking to you, right? Yeah. I didn't have to say a word. I could have just stayed silent the entire time, but I'm not that type of rude person who just doesn't say anything we're all humans right so i prefer to just communicate a little bit but i'm not gonna give up my rights just because of her fears so so what you'll need to do and here, here's the here's the problem this is a private roadway but the only thing is is what he what he's saying if the hoa has signs up saying that it's private property yeah or so let's see we, we actually, if we if we had that up there and signs were on there, we could actually pull them out of the car and lock them up, turn them across that. Yeah, they do, can't do that. Do, do we, You'd have yeah, to give can, me the do, opportunity do, 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 to do leave. We don't have the signs up there. There's nothing that we can do to take action right now. Mom, right let me now, tell you how trespassing works. You'd have to give me the opportunity to leave, okay? That, exactly. And he exactly. said he would pull me out of the car. You see what? No, I exactly you said. See what yeah, happens? He would have to give you the chance to leave. We you see what happened? No, he didn't. What was his words exactly? We could have I, I, pulled him out of the car. Let me, no, let me, let me. But I'm just saying, you that. see sorry. why you we don't call cops? You know find out what's because going on and ignorance is bliss, leave. and people like this cause, cause harm to innocent people like no, me who are doing nothing me. wrong by pulling me out. Then I will sue their department from from now till to the end of time. Okay, especially Sir, him. I, I misstated the term. Okay, what I said, we would we would make contact with you. Okay, and then if you refused to leave. Then we would take action. That is yeah. the correct procedure yeah, right sorry. there. Not I'm yank sorry. me out of the car. I'm sorry. All right? There's a proper procedure. I'm very well aware of all the procedures, okay? So that's why certain things can't fly by me. I know my rights. It's definitely important to factor in that the man was parked legally on the street. 
so I'm really not sure why the homeowner felt the need to call the cops. The cops said that it was private property, with zero evidence backing up their claims, not even signs up in the area. Clearly, this is what the homeowner must have thought as well. The cop also failed in trying to get the man's ID. He didn't just fail, but he failed miserably. It's funny how the cop was speaking at the end. He misspeaks. I don't, am I being detained? You requested a supervisor. I, but again, am I being detained? Right now you are because you requested a I'm being detained. So me requesting a supervisor requires me to be detained? You Think about that now. This video is brought to us by Good Citizen. Be sure to subscribe to their channel and to show them support by checking out their videos. As always, the link to the channel will be down in the description. The video begins with a man filming outside the Baltimore City towing section. The man is outside the facility on a public road. The security call the cops and say that it's private. The cop thinks that the man is trespassing and calls the sergeant. We all know that if a cop thinks you are trespassing, it doesn't mean much. Watch to see what the sergeant does next. Baltimore City, towing section. My name is Officer Moore. Officer Moore? Yes. So is this not public property? No. It, it belongs to the, to the city, right? Yeah, but you can't be down here recording. Well, why not? Why are you down here recording? It doesn't matter why I'm down here recording. Does it not belong? If it belongs to the you city. Got property Listen, are you gonna listen or you gonna cut me off? Do you have property? Are you gonna listen or cut me off? Do you have property? Or are you gonna listen or you gonna cut me off? Can you answer my question? You gonna answer mine? Look, bro. We not about to do this. Oh. We not about to do this. You ain't supposed to come out. We not. We supposed to stay up there. Are you law enforcement? I'm scared. Okay, we'll call law enforcement. Let's just say remains officer Devon. Everything's been been out of record. All right. Officer Devon. Yeah. Okay. Badge number. Oh, I appreciate that. Thank you. No What's going on? Just so you, just so they explain. You say that you're trespassing. It's posted as well. No trespassing. Do you have your ID with you? I do have to give you. I do have an ID. Have oh, I don't have it on me. Actually, no, I don't. You have your name, date of birth. I do, but I don't plan on giving it to you. Okay, so you do know what's going to happen if you don't provide any name, date of birth, according to the investigation here, right? What's going to happen? You can tell me. Possibly get arrested, all right? Possibly get arrested for, for what crime? Trespassing. It's posted. So those signs are referencing this. This Is this not a public Is this not public property? So listen, it's posted along the whole entire fence here. Right, that's go going inside the perimeter. But that's, but that's for the perimeter. So you can I actually? I didn't go beyond the perimeter. I didn't go you beyond You are beyond, actually, you're beyond the premises once you come into the facility. There's no signs up there that says, okay. no. so where's the trespass line at? Okay, okay, you're asking where the trespass line is. Yeah, where the trespass line is. Okay, at? we have it right here where you are right now, right? Right? Uh, right, it. right now where you are, sure. we have it. Mm -hmm. so, what, what I'm doing is I'm, I'm exercising my right to that, record that, in public. Listen, that's fine. All I'm saying, if this, them being a part of the city, this is public property. I get that. Now, they also have no trespassing. So, well, I'm asking, where does where does the line lay of trespassing? Because this is a this, this is not a regular street. No, no, of course not. So this, where where is the is line? Not, this is not a street that regular vehicles come upon. This where is also. the trespass line? So, Basically, oh. if you're not coming for business city something? official business, you can only like there a place where you can be right now is at the top of a lot. Totally. Here, you're not. Conducting any business. I am conducting business. With, with yes. your official business. My, my, I told you, my first thing, just like I told him, is exercising my right to record in public. I am documenting okay. for my story. Being reasonable right now. Do you have your like a name, date of birth? I'm I do, but I'm not giving it to you. I don't have to give it to you. Okay. Did you call a supervisor out here? They're already coming. Oh, okay, I appreciate so with that. that being said, so I'm not saying anything else you can hold out with him. You can hold out with him okay. I don't am I being detained? I, but again, am I being detained? Right now you are because you're requesting I'm being detained. Okay. So me requesting a supervisor requires me to be detained? You Think about that now. Him. Doesn't matter. If, if he take too long, I can leave freely. Why you just don't leave now? Right there. So we just walked the entire property. There's no trespassing. There's no sign saying no trespassing up until that fence. Is that, we, we in agreement to that? So I'm going to walk up to the gate of where it says no trespassing because everything else is open to the public. How you doing, sir? Hey, good. How you doing? Can you, can you say your name and badge number? I can't, I can't even hear or see. Manaya. Manaya. Badge number? 
197. 197. Okay. Uh, so pretty much today, um, I had two things that I was doing here. One exercise in my rage to record in public. Uh, there was no signs all the way down that said like trespassing, uh, authorized personnel only. My state law, they should be, it has to be posted in clear view. That's not, that's not done here. The signs that they're referencing is on the fence line, which kind of indicates on the other side, like all of that beyond the gate area, which is, I guess you'd be trespassing if you go beyond the area. Henson being restricted per se. This road right here, there, when well, he is saying that this road is private, this is not a private road. It's state property, which means it's public property. In some stations, it says no trespassing on the fence. I can walk along the edge of the fence of any police department. That's the middle of the street. I'm right there with you. Again, this street is not restricted. I can walk the street. I can walk the street if I like. What's going on? So, she just called two space two 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 zero per state's attorney. If you get charged, a representative of the facility telling you to leave public property. Correct. Public property for trespassing. Trespassing. Based off of for. Again, and I asked him, where is that to leave premises? It's like if we're going to your house and we're on your front lawn and you say you got to go and I refuse, and that's what she just did. That's, no, but that's, that's private property, sir. That's private property. For public property, time, place, manner, as long as the business hours are open, I could be on the property. Well, not by the state's attorney. Not by the state's attorney? Well, I just got off the phone with him. Well, the, I asked him, where was the line? Sir, all right, we're not going to be here all day. Oh, I'm going to go to the line. Oh, you're, you're leaving the property, sir. Okay, well, I'll leave the property. Public property. They trying to trespass on public property. Well, that's definitely, this is definitely an unlawful trespass. It's not like this is my first rodeo. This will be essentially your first warning. This is a verbal warning. Say that you cannot come across the premises. They've given you verbal warning. They've also stated, posted as well. This is a warning from us telling you, hey, you cannot be on this premises. You come back tomorrow. No biggie. We'll be back. I feel like these officers just chose to ignore the fact that the man was filming on a public road. Not even in the facility. He was outside of it. The security is just as bad as the cops for calling them in the first place and saying to the man that it is private. And the cop made it even worse when he said that the man was trespassing. The sergeant is then called and we can only hope he can help the situation. But no. The sergeant trespassed the man from the public property. Yes, the public property. All three of the different roles all thought the man was trespassing. Very worrying. She's from, a jailer. from what newspaper? No, it's from not a jailer, minute. baby. Everybody Get it right. right. I'm the warden. The five oh, she's the, the warden. warden. The Even worse. We're not on the property anymore. Yeah, we're still yeah, right are. here. Sit on that road out there. This clip is brought to us by Michelle's Mobile Media. A big shout out to Michelle. Make sure you guys go and check out her channel. Give her videos a watch. As always, don't forget to subscribe, and her link will be down in the description. The clip starts off with Michelle and a fellow auditor filming at the Waltz Hall Sheriff's Department. A warden tells them to stop filming and to leave the property. The warden gets quite aggressive. More deputies then show up and force them off of the public property. I want you guys to give this one a watch, and let me know down in the comments how bad of a department this is. We can't what? I didn't hear that. I can't hear you either. <laughs> right there it says no parking. What? Which one? None of your business. What's your name? Which one? Uh, y'all were working in both of these vehicles. Y'all, you saw me up there doing that. No, but I see you with you need to de-escalate, lady. I don't know who you think you're talking to, but you're not talking to a bunch of criminals out of here. No, ma'am. You need to de-escalate. We're out in public. De-escalate. Go back inside. Wow.
You need to de-escalate. Go back inside. Actually, we weren't. Actually, we weren't. You did really good at the beginning, but then all of this. So. Wow. You're going to have to de-escalate. Wow. Wow. There's no signs. You need to go inside. No, it's not. Wow. <laughs> All right, so we've got, are you lieutenant? This is public. This is far, no. Are you lieutenant? This is as far as you can go. Because this is a correctional facility. This which makes it is left. No. Oh my Austin God. Real. When you so start, do you, you want to tell me how you pronounce it? Don't erase that because I'm going to get that. Riles. It's, 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 are you going to yeah, disturb the public? I'm Who really are we disturbing? Who? Hey, I, did, did, did I get anybody out here? Did I tell all these people to come out here? Because she's from, a jailer. From what newspaper? No, it's from not a jailer. Minutes. Minutes. Everybody get it right. I'm the warden. Oh, she's the warden. Even worse. We're not on the property anymore. Yeah, we're still right here. Get on that road out there. This is property. Get are you sure? Phone. Are you yes, sure I this am. is public? Yes, I am. You're sure that this is public? Excuse me. You sure right. this isn't public because it's right Excuse there? Excuse me. The go ahead. No, go ahead. Go ahead. Get on the road. This is still the prop the property of the, the correction facility. Uh, public all property. of this is. Oh, this isn't the Sir, easement right here? In the road. I know so you what you're to, trying so you to, to do. Get it's not this work. isn't the easement get right here? Oh, we can't get in the road. You can't walk in the road. Oh, I don't care where you get if as long as you're not on this property. Now okay. get. We're on the easement. This is the easement. Positive um, about that. That's fine. Okay. All right. Okay. Stay in there and act Dude, listen to the show. Go ahead, Warden. I'm sorry. I said, go ahead, Warden. With what? Cherie. Doing whatever you need Cherie. to do. Cherie, go back to work. Yep, I'm sure you guys will agree with me on this one when I say that this department was terrible. They really got more deputies to show up just for Michelle and the fellow auditor because they were filming. As well, for the Warden to straight up tell them to stop filming and to leave, and then to also get aggressive just seems way over the top. I'm not sure why the deputies forced them to get off the property as well. As I said, it's an all-around terrible department. Don't forget to let me know down in the comments what you think about this department. That is, uh, you got a Recording category. public interest. Do you have a category? I mean, it, what public interest. For? Public interest for... Well, isn't that something? This clip is brought to us by For The Record. Make sure you guys go and check out their channel. Their link will be down in the description. Don't forget to subscribe to their channel and watch their videos for more like this clip. The clip starts off with a man filming in the Bernalillo County's office. An allied security guard questions the man about why he's recording and tells him not to catch private information. To be fair to the guard, he is quite funny and certainly makes some interesting faces, but it doesn't quite end here yet. Coming down here to the Bernalillo County so I can get a uh, visual layout. Hello. Hello, sir. How you doing? Good, good. How you doing? Can I help you? I know. I was just uh, you getting so this, this here. What's going on with the desks? Do you have an appointment here? I don't need an appointment, sir. Well, if you don't have an appointment, you don't need to be talking to me. What's that? If you don't have an appointment, they can't do anything for you. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, so you would refer? You no, know, you're going to have to go downstairs and make an appointment. You know, the, the kiosk that you sign in? Does everybody else make an appointment? Everybody that comes over here needs to be accounted for. No, they don't. Yeah. No, they don't. Or what? So we can know what your business is. We keep a log of it. 
Uh, so, so you so can know it, what our business is, so you can keep track of that business, and they want to, well, it's just like how you keep your records, they have their records. Mm -hmm. Same thing. But what would they need those records for? Because they want to keep a record about your transaction. Mm -hmm. I don't have to reveal so who I you, am, first so, of all. So would you? And so, with a kiosk. So is just asking. one thing. Um, if you were to take a credit card transaction at a gas station, are you going to ask them to erase it too? That's a credit card transaction. That's uh, that's, still your that's having to do with money. That's, uh, that's the same thing. It's your information. That's banking, no? That's that's, that's banking. your information. That's your. That's you. So if you have some business, let's go make an appointment. And this is my business right here. This is my business filming. It's not an appointment with these people. No, no, not an appointment with them. Mm -hmm. No, this is general business. Yes, general business for... For press. For press. What kind of press? What do you think press is? Uh, you got Recording public interest. Do you have a category? I mean, it, what do you... Public interest. For? Public interest for... Isn't that self-explanatory, no, sir? No, it's not. There's a lot of categories. Public interest. interest I'm, it's of, general. Of general. There's no specific, no specific uh, category. General press. General. Anything of public interest. Okay, so you're, what you're saying is, but, you're just recording anything and everything. There you go. You got it. Just anything and everything. There you go. Ding, 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 ding. Okay. You made it, man. You got it. Mm -hmm. Anything. Anyone. Anyone. For what, Any... for what purpose? I mean, like, are you just recording just for the fun Cause... of it? Or are you recording it just to be able to, I don't know, look up something? Just getting the floor layout. Mm -hmm. Only one thing I would ask you, please refrain from, is to record the inside of the offices because they have documents and stuff about this personal information. I'm not trying to record anybody's no, just personal saying. information. And just saying. Just saying. And that ain't up to me to do that. That's up to them to well, take care of their... point the camera not at the services. That's all I'm asking for. If you could please... uh, that's what you're asking yeah, for, I'm... but it's up to them to take care of that. They're not supposed to have stuff out well, there. Well, it's not even People's good to private other stuff. private stuff, is it? They shouldn't have it out in the public. They're working. They're working. They're going to have it out they because should... they're working with it. They shouldn't have it, is what I'm saying. They shouldn't this have it out in the public. What are you going to do at your workspace? The workspace for... Uh, to keep people's stuff private. Yes, who's who's working, to say? Who's to say the person right here right isn't watching the next person right, right there? Down. My intent mm -hmm. isn't to try to record people's personal stuff. But well, you just said it was okay. If they, I said it's, they're the one that have their stuff out there in the open. So, like, in, for instance, I'm not saying it's okay for them to put people's yeah, private stuff out there. But that's if I happen place. to be courting, if mm -hmm. I happen to be recording, mm -hmm. they need to keep that private. So that's their in, responsibility, in, in not words, mine responsibility. To, other, for me, it's oh, consideration. I understand what you're I would have to be so considerate in, and consider so standing from their the stuff. of their viewpoint, do they have to remember your face if that's the case? What do you mean? Because you say it's their responsibility to hide it, right? Hide their personal information. Yes. Yeah. So, so they have to watch for a person with a camera walking around and be like, oh, put everything away. What's so hard about that? That's all right. But um, if anything, that's me. Oh, well, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you know, I got John to talk that's to and all. Over there. That's my company. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. All right, man. Well, I appreciate it, man. Absolutely. Yeah. I'd like to. Yeah, I'd like mm. to know your story too. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. All right. Hey, appreciate it, man. Take Absolutely, it easy. Sir. Yeah, we'll do that. All right, you too. Well, it's all good for the security to pull some interesting faces and come across as funny, but at the end of the day, all that matters is if he does his job properly and comes across as a nice individual. And to be fair. The guard didn't push the matter any further despite having a bit of an unprofessional attitude. The guard did warn the man not to catch private information, although this is usually a lot less than the others do, which is call the cops. The man can still record anywhere that is public. The man did have to end up educating him as well. What's happening, boss? How you doing? Can I help you out with anything? No. All good? I'm all good. This video is brought to us by Tulare County Cop Watch. Be sure to subscribe to their channel and to show them support by checking out their videos. As always, the link to the channel will be down in the description. The video begins with a man filming around Corcoran, California. 
A store employee confronts the man about him recording. Says if the man doesn't say why he is taking pictures, then he can't be taking them. The cops are then called. And the cop doesn't quite act how the employee would have expected when they called for the cops. Watch to find out what happens next. Orphan, California. Hello. Hey, can I help you with something? Oh, no. no. Oh. Figure out what's going on. Yeah, yeah, I was just taking some pictures. Thought it looked nice. Oh, okay. Can I? Okay. Is it okay? Uh, I mean, it, it's kind of abnormal, but whatever. I'm just checking out. If you can't tell me what the pictures are for, sir, you can't take pictures. Okay, well, I'm just going to take a few pictures. Well, not pictures, but video, if that's okay. Well, to be honest, it's not okay unless you talk to my manager. Got Corcoran PD showing up. How you doing? Can I help you out with anything? No. All good? I'm all good, man. So we got the PD showing up. All right, guys, here we go. Oh yeah, and they never asked me to leave, so I don't have to leave. I haven't been asked to leave, and I don't have to leave the sidewalk anyways. So you're all good, man? I'm good, man. Can I get your name and badge number real quick? Yeah, my name's Daniel McAllister. My badge number is 15126. Thank you. I'm gonna get real close to get a thumbnail, man. Just a thumbnail. Come on, man. Hey, can you show me the meanest mean mug you can show? Man, I'm ugly, not mean. Hey, that's what gets me the views, man. It's just a mean mug. All right, man, you take care of yourself. You too, man. Dog. Thank you. Very professional. Big shout out to this officer right here from Corcoran PD. Big shout out to the Corcoran PD. Thank you for respecting my rights. That is well then, it's safe to say that this female employee really wasn't expecting the cops to side with the man recording, and also for the cop to then educate them. A very good cop in our perspective, but in this employee's perspective, probably not as good. I've definitely never heard someone say that if the person recording doesn't give a reason for why they're recording or taking pictures, then they aren't allowed to record unless they give the reason. And if anyone actually believes this, then I don't know what to say. I don't know, but that just seems very weird to me. Thanks for making it to the end of the video, guys. Once again, make sure to like the video if you enjoyed, and subscribe for your daily dose of police encounters.